Okay, in this video we are going to do a very simple math problem and you are going to be surprised that many of you are actually going to get this wrong. So I don't want you to use your calculator right here because here is a problem. We have only 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 and times 0 in the end, yeah? And a lot of students do this common mistake, yeah? And right now I suggest you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself. Right here we have a lot of options A, B, C. So right now choose one option, what do you think is a correct answer? And then after 30 seconds we will check our answer and I'm going to show you um, most common mistake right here. Okay, let's try to solve it, because whatever order we select, obviously, is going to create a different answer, right? So only we need to understand what is the correct order to do this problem. And for this question, I have this PMDMC order, we need to work according to PMDMC order, because this is the main popular order in the world, all internet libraries, scientific graphing calculators works according to PMDMC, yeah? And let's look at this PMDMC order. What is the first step? This PMDMC order works from the top to the bottom right here. And the first step is parentheses. In our case, we don't have any parentheses, so we just skip this part and go to the next step. Exponents, we don't have squares, cubes, so we just skip this we just skip this part. The next step, we have multiplication, but this is main common mistake right here, because you think that the third step is multiplication, but we need to add to this step a division, yeah? So this is as a group, yeah? Multiplication and division. And let's scan, are there any multiplication or division signs? Right here we have multiplication sign, so this is our case. So I just reread this problem right here real quick, so 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 and times 0. So here is here is our problem right here and this is our case. This is the multiplication case. And now we need to scan where it is our multiplication sign. Multiplication sign is right here, yeah, in the end. So we need to multiply it first because as, as you can see right here, addition is after multiplication, yeah? So we need to multiply it first this, this step. If I multiply it, right here we'll have this addition, so I just rewrite this, so 4 plus 4 plus 4, and right here, 4 times 0 equal to 0, so we will have like plus 0, yeah? So this is maybe the main step right here. Okay, we don't have division, then the next step, addition and subtraction. We have, addi we have addition, so this is our classic case, we all le learned this stuff in the third grade, this is classic, uh, classic addition right here, so 4 plus 4 plus 4 equal to equal to 12. So this is our answer according to PMDMC. And right now I'm going to show you the main common mistake right here, because a lot of students, I read this question right here once more, so 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 and times 0. A lot of students learn that if you multiply by 0, the answer is 0. And right here we have this option A, which is a very tricky moment, because a lot of students think, okay, multiplying by 0, we have 0 right here. But this is not correct, because According to PMDMC, a correct answer is 12. But if you want to multiply by 0, you just need to put parentheses right here. And then your correct answer will be 0. Because you need to start from parentheses. If you start from these parentheses, your, your first step is these parentheses, yeah? Right here. Then you will have like the right here, the sum give us uh, 16, yeah? And the next step times 0. So this give us 0. But in our case, we don't have these parentheses. So our correct answer is option option 12, so I write right here real quick, so answer, answer, a correct answer is option, option B, but I'm going to mention this really interesting and important moment. So this is correct with parentheses, but right here we don't have parentheses, so just forget about this solution. Really interesting question, definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, okay? Now if you need to learn basic math, interesting brain test, you can easily subscribe to my channel, I try to help everyone, I have a lot of brain tests, really interesting algebra, tricky problems, like not hard, just like relaxing problem, but really in, in really interesting interpretation and I hope you, you enjoy it. So definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, thank you for your time, have a great day!